want you to look inside and find your power animal. Mine is a penguin. Slide. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Exotic Matter. Yes, we uh, discovered quite a bit in the last episode. I think we did a good thing. Now I want to explore up um, and see what is located on the second floor of our little shippy. There was an elevator, but I um, it led to like an enclosed room, so I'm hoping that there's going to be... Yeah, see? There's some different stuff to explore now here. We got some more logs to read and stuff like that. Is this a uh, access terminal card thing? Is that what I need? Access card. What about this? Doo -doo. Oh, I need another one. I need one more. One more gain. Alright then. We can do that. Just burn my way through there. I don't know why. <laughs> I know the Criterion was built very quickly and the whole venture was pretty experimental, but this door opening mechanisms drive me nuts. Standing here and aiming through the window at the sensor panel doesn't work. Would be good to get inside. Looks like it might be worthwhile. Oh? I got it. Brutal force it is. Not just aiming at the sensor, but actually throwing an item with Q does the trick. Works for me since I was a pretty good pitcher in my ma Maloon team at high school. I love to play. Yeah, I want to play. Let's pitch with Q. Look at that. Piece of cake. What you think about that? Oh, there's another SCOM here. Maybe I should leave it, just in case I end up dying or something like that. Then I won't be completely screwed. But do you lose your drill when you die? Can I craft another one? Hmm. Interesting that. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't quite know what to make of it yet. Well, let's see what else they have on this floor. A couple containers. Seems to not be holding much, though. And then, uh, another mysterious machine. I don't know what to do with yet. Peter, my crewmate, was not just an excellent Zavon player, but also the best engineer I ever met. He could create things out of thin air, like a magician. I thought of him when I managed to build a working battery. I just needed silicone and some duct tape. Proud of my resourcefulness. Silicone and duct tape makes a battery? Are you sure? Looks like some Walter White type shit, you know? He's like, oh, I got some jars and I put, uh, washers in there. Nuts and bolts and <laughs> shit. And it, uh, it becomes magic. So it seems like that's the elevator back down. This is an empty room? No, there's a terminal here. If the apocalypse comes, I would feel well equipped with two things at hand. A beautiful woman and some duct tape. Have been trying to get more duct tape the whole time. And just now, oh mother nature, I thank thee. I discovered that out of four leaves I can make duct tape. Just the woman's not that easy to build. True, true. I mean, why would you want to build a woman that leaves anyways? It was like a BuzzFeed Bunk episode that uh, there was a guy that built a woman out of lint. And I was just uh, extremely off-put by that. <laughs> That's a pretty good series. I enjoy that series. If you haven't checked out my uh, BuzzFeed Bunk videos, you should feel free to do so. Oh look, secret room? Secret room? Wall? Well, I don't... I don't know what any of these machines do. But I did find another secret room, so that's something. Hey, Paisanos! It's the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. Hmm. How about this? This room? Yeah. I don't think we've been in here yet. Oh. Hello? What the fuck? Why? Am I being trolled right now? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? A um, little bit of sand, more ignimbrite. I guess uh, 99 is the maximum stack, or did I just happen to get 99? 
99 is the maximum stack. Okay. That's good to know. Um, trapped in this room for ages. Can't believe the irony, being among the ones to first leave my solar system, but not being able to leave the room. How can I get through that damn door? Yeah, it's on the fritz, isn't it? It's Borkin. Took me some time to put a block on the correct yellow marked position so the door stays open to let me through. I guess the lab rat's not so dumb after all. Yellow marked position. Okay, we can do that. Hey. Dang, oh. That's some programming know-how. I tell you what. Uh, what do we got here? Another access card. Okay, cool. So now I can get through that other locked door. And if there's a third access card, then I'm, I'm screwed. <laughs> then it's over for me. I gotta go back upstairs, eh? wonder if there's any other terminals or something. For now, I guess uh, uncovering the mystery of that locked door will uh, satiate me enough. Let's see, where's my card? I got a card here somewhere. Yeah. There you go. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, it's like an airlock. One door opens, one door closes. Interesting. Does this lead outside as well? Ship wall cracked. Okay, we can rebuild our ship, I guess. Get a couple more grenades. I don't think that was really worth the trouble. But whatever. I I keep trying to open the door just by like running into it. Alright, there's my airlock. Oh yeah, it leads outside. Tried some of these strange fruits that grow outside. First I thought they taste like Granny's apple pie, but then they reminded me more of the taste of Vite. An incredible me, I figured if they taste like Vite, perhaps I could make some Vite. DIY Vite. D-I-Y-B-I-T-E? Is that what you're trying to say, or do you just call it Vite? Probably just call it Vite. Because that's, uh... Yeah. It rolls off the tongue a little better, doesn't it? So let's see what I got here. Can I build across? Just a little bit. Thank you so much. Wow. I don't know if this water will kill me or what. It doesn't look normal. So I'm going to uh, err on the side of caution and not jump in the water. Because I don't really know what happens when you die in this game either. So, get the ant. We got two sand, ignimbrite, silicone. Oh, I can make the batteries with silicone. I just have to keep digging more sand to get more silicone. And uh, if I can find leaves somewhere, that would be a great help as well in building the batteries. Which I don't really know what they're for. There doesn't seem to be a crafting menu or anything like that. But, uh, we'll do what we can. We'll figure out what's going on at some point. Maybe I'll build, uh, another base. A second base. Super base. Hmm. Alright, there's one. There's two. Nope, too low. <laughs> there. Oh god. Am I gonna... can get back up this, right? <laughs> I'm scared I'm gonna run out of blocks. <gasps> no, no, no! Oh my god, I almost slid off the edge. That's an interesting mechanic. You can slide. Slide! I want you to look inside and find your power animal. Mine is a penguin. Slide. Alright, so... You seem to be in business. There's my staircase back home. My stairway to heaven, as it were. We've made it to the ground, folks. Now I can uh, start collecting more silicone. Silicone. Delicious. Is this part of the ship as well? Or is this a different kind of uh, terrain? Interesting. 
I guess I could uh, figure it out like this. Ho ho ho! Whoa. <laughs> A little bit of lag there. Basalt. Okay, so yeah, it's not part of the ship. I just need to upgrade my driller in some way in order to be able to mine this stuff a little bit better. I guess that makes good sense. You want to have a bit of progression in your games, don't ya? Um, where's that light? There we go. Slap it up there. Dang. Let's just, just go down. I'm a little scared. Probably not going to be able to get through here anyways. Because it's all that uh, hard rock, right? Hard rock cafe. Oh. I've come up on the bottom of the water? How the fuck does that work? I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know what this is supposed to be. I'm scared. Alright. Let's try and dig my way back out. Not bad. It ain't too bad. I don't want to waste my grenades trying to dig because I, I don't think that's the way to do it. Unless there's a way to craft more grenades, which there might be. But yeah, I assume that there would be a way to upgrade your drill. So that's what I want to try. But I'm going to need more uh, leaves. Leaves so I can make duct tape. So I can combine all this silicone that I found. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That sounds like a plan to me. Mm, there's some leaves over there. What about the water? About it. What about it? Um, let's build up a little bit. Like so. And then... Yeah, I really like that you're just able to shoot that across. All right. Let's build this way. It's one step down, right? Okay. That's looking good. And then like this. I will make my way over there, damn it. I just have to remember how to get back. Okay. That's looking nice. Real nice. Spiffy and a jiffy. Where'd the fucking plant go? Oh, it's over there. Alright. Gives me that. I really don't want to run out of this stuff. I mean, I think I do have more than I started with. Let's double check that. Nope. I had 107 and now I have 72. So I need to do some mining. Lest I, uh... Am unable to build things further. But yeah. My mission for now? Leaves. Lots of leaves. Yeah. Delicious. I guess I should cut the tree too. See what that do. I don't want to kill all the trees because then they might not reproduce or... I assume that's how things work. I assume like most of this game is is similar to Minecraft in its uh, in its function because Minecraft does really well with that. Oh God, there is fall damage. Just uh, for the record. Well, now I need to find my way back up. I've got a shit ton of leaves. Let's see. Crafting. Okay. So let's um. Make duct tape. That'll do. I like that. 30, so we can make 10 more. I should probably keep some leaves, just in case. Well, I mean, they're fucking everywhere out here. But yeah. I don't really know how it works. A nutty fruit. Want to eat some nutty fruit? Anyone? Alright. So we got some duct tape, we got some silicone. I'll need to uh, farm up a little bit more silicone, I do think. But yeah, happy to make a little more progress. We're doing things. Big things every day. 
Oh god. How can I find my way back to the ship? There it is. <laughs> Freaking me out, man. Anyway, friends, this has been Exotic Matter. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. If you did enjoy the episode, please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. We've also got links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon. If you'd like to support me on any of those, that would be massively, massively appreciated. I'm really enjoying this game. It, um, yeah, it is able to capture me in a, a certain way that Minecraft was not able to. I guess it's because of all the technology and, yeah, exploding stuff with a grenade within the first few minutes really helps a lot. <laughs> Anyways, I hope that you'll join us for the next one. We're going to do a bit more exploring, see what those batteries are all about, and uh, it should be a good time. So, I'll see you then. Thank you once again for watching. This has been Exotic Matter. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. And until then, friends, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.